Hello everybody and welcome back to a brand new episode of Rising Road. How are you guys all out there doing today? Um, first and foremost, I want to talk to you guys about why I haven't been building the subscriber homes in quite a very long time, okay? Um, I kind of stopped doing that because I wanted to go out and wing it, have a little bit of fun. Um, I wanted to start work on like Fallor City and some vaults and doing some other work in the world. And then the developer not notably told us that there would be some changes coming to the game. So I went all the way out there on a great big adventure and I took you guys all the way out there and we had some fun. We built a road that came all the way through here. I built him a house and uh, hopefully you guys got a chance to see that as well. We even came over here. We cleared out my home and we got ourselves a pet fox. Okay. And w over here, over here guys, we decided to bring in the saloon from Dagaline's world and it is really nice I kind of like it I added this in over here for like a still of sorts I've been wanting a cornfield inside the game for quite a long time since day one I've always wanted this so <coughs> pardon me so I got all of the corn that I put I could find in the world that I got and I planted it all. So we got all that. It's planted. It's going to take a while for it to grow. And it's going to take a while for me to fill this thing with corn. Along with the trees. Okay, now I still got some fruit trees I could plant. But I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to put those things away. Now, the entire reason for me doing this, guys, is I wanted to make this look good. Alright, I wanted to kind of just kind of do some work with you guys you know make it look nice but at the same time i wanted to enjoy this so it wasn't so much as just i didn't want you guys to feel as though i was neglecting you or anything of that sort but i just wanted to do something a bit different okay um the subscriber homes they're always still on okay and this goes for she wolf out there as well too and everyone else okay i will get back to building your subscriber homes i promised you guys that and i'm not about to break that okay what i did is just go out and take a little bit of a break from all of that okay i wanted to come over here and get the gardens going okay so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead, plop these things inside of here. I'm going to go ahead and shove that in there. Let's see here. All right, yeah, just shove these in here as well. I got some broccoli. I got some food on me. We're going to go ahead. I guess we could take some carrots with me as well. Um, that should be good. That should be good enough. Um, up there, guys, that is the subscriber towers, okay? Now, all of this down here is supposed to be the food, the uh, subscriber gardens, now, this is basically supposed to represent everything. Pardon me. Let me turn those reflections off because we're getting a little bit of lag spikes in the area. Let's go ahead and turn that off. And we're going to hop on Savior here. There he goes. Um, but these right here, guys, these are supposed to be a portion of the subscriber towers and the subscriber towers they have a little bit of a garden okay so basically i have a lot of subscribers i don't know who you are so i decided i wanted to build this and there's a little bit of a pathway that we built in creative mode now this comes down straight through here and you'd be able to just kind of like meander your way down through the pathway through a little bit of a forest alongside of it and come the whole way up here and just like kick back, relax, and do your thing, you know? I wanted to add like a little bit of gazebo and all that other stuff and things. So up here is this subscriber high rises. All right, I'm gonna go ahead, get off my horse here for a moment and hit F2. And we're gonna fly for a little bit. So I've done a lot of flying in this game all over the place. I really do like using fly mode. I know sometimes some of you guys are like, you know what? flying around it's like the hand of god you know you're flying around you're going up you're going down and it's kind of hard to focus i understand that but for me guys whenever i turn the hud off it gives you a nice little overview as to what everything is like 
and it shows you the world in general okay um, I use the fly mode for fast construction for stuff like this I could in theory go inside of here and build every single floor individually honestly I don't want to do that <laughs> I don't want to do that um, I'll be doing this for the next century um, which is kind of one of the reasons why I don't want to mess around with that. We got the roads that we still have to do inside of this world, which is probably kind of pointless at this point because of the new update coming along. But I may keep it, okay? I'm, I think I'm going to keep this world. Um, even with the new update coming along, yes, I may keep it. Um, if the other world does not... If the new version does not kind of like work with this, pardon me as I stutter over my own tongue here. Um, if the new version doesn't work out quite well, then we'll step back to this and we'll just continue working on what we have. Um, over here, okay, over here. If I'm going to go ahead, pull up my map, all right. We've built quite a lot in this area, guys. Okay, quite a lot. All right, this right here is a subscriber high rises. You can see where the road comes out. We have our tower over here. This thing comes down to this. And then over here is where I wanted to expand out for all of the subscriber homes. Now, I backtracked away from this because of some updates and stuff and things that were announced. And I will be coming back to this, okay? I told you guys this, and I wanted to uh, come back to it. So this is what I want you guys to do for me, okay? I want you guys to please give me the time to complete this project right here, okay? Give me the time to complete this project. We're going to complete this right here, the subscriber high rises. And after this is done... I want to start running the road, bring it down here, and I want to run this road, you know, add the yellow and the white lines in, I want to start being able to shoot this thing down that way, planning it out, okay? You can't just plant down a bunch of houses all over the place without a road in place, okay? You have to kind of plan it out. So that's kind of like what I'm doing right now. I'm just planning everything ahead of time. So I want you guys to understand, hey, look, I haven't forgotten about any of you at all, okay? Um, I do have some houses I still have yet to complete. Like this is Jairus Means House over here. Um, I got to kind of clear it out. It's got all kinds of things in it. We still got Christmas trees sitting outside from... <laughs> from last year that thing has gone way up um i should probably update that at some time um let's see here you know what let's go since we're in fly mode i think what i'm going to do is i'm going to take you down to one of our completed projects and i could probably just walk down there okay let's just do that let's just f2 down and let's just start walking down here okay now, mind the lag. We got Smilo Saber Cats over here. This house is complete. It looks really nice on the inside, okay? A lot of these houses over here, we got four homes. They are complete. We got more homes. They are complete. I got some telephone poles I want to add to this world. Lots of trees. You know, I just want to add a little bit of this to it, okay? I want to bring my world to life. I want to be able to take the time in the I want to be able to take the time for this guys and if I don't have to take my time and do it the way I want to then everything's just not gonna work out right and I want you guys to understand hey look I haven't forgot about your what I told you before I'm here okay I'm gonna build your world I'm gonna build your homes I haven't forgotten about you and inside of here, we do have to add some NPCs. Now, some of these NPCs, I really, 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 really wish there was other ways. Like, we could put, like, 
little hats on them and stuff and things of that sort and have them just like kind of walk around the entire place we put a lot of effort into this guys this is really cool you know i've invited a couple of you over here and we've put a lot of effort into this you know the lighthouse has turned into one beautiful post-apocalyptic feel and i really 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 do like the way this thing turned out okay i mean look at this we got bunks over here. We got bunks upstairs. Uh, well, downstairs and just about everywhere. It turned out really good. I did a nice job on this. Okay, we got bunks right there. There should be a ladder, but I can I must have forgot to put that in. But that's not the point, guys. I like to take my time and do things right so I don't mess up on them. There he goes. So this thing, it turned out really nice. That door over there just closed on its own. Okay. Um, <laughs> but this thing, it turned out really good. Okay. And I want to expand this thing coming across the world, guys. Um, I gave you guys a choice in the beginning on roads. Okay. And there was this point. There was this with these sidewalks or we added the more modern approach and a lot of you guys seem to like the more modern approach right here okay where we added this in or we added this or if we added this one in right here M many choices i gave you guys many choices and you seem to like my original approach i started with in the beginning and that was this so yeah I think we'll go ahead, we'll stick with this one right here. Now, I did this with blocks and beams, but it it's, it's the curves. It's the curves that throw me off. That's why I wanted to do this with material instead of blocks and beams, because I just wanted it to be different. But I suppose we can do this with the blocks and all that other stuff and things. The subscriber pond, it looks pretty nice. We still need some stuff and things for these. Um, she Wolf, you will get a home. Once I start doing the, uh, once I get the subscriber towers done, I ask for your patience. Once again, please allow me to get the subscriber towers done, please. And I will start building these subscriber homes once more. Um, I had a lot of plans for this world, guys. A lot. And I know that I took a break and went out and started doing a lot of other stuff and things. But we're back over here, okay? We're like in the part two of this season. We are well beyond 200 episodes into this. And I got some unfinished projects. I want to finish these up, okay? I want to finish this up. This thing, it's kind of one of those things where you look at it and you're just like, hmm, well, how long will this take? I can't give you an accuracy as to how long this will take. These roads right here, if I knew somebody that could come over here and just bloop, and just make it look like an actual slope, make it look really nice, that would be good. But I don't because well, I do know somebody that can, but I just can't bother people all the time to say, hey, look, I need your help with this. Can you do this? Can you do this? Can you do this? Because that's aggravating, okay? That's the whole point of playing this game is to learn to do this stuff on your own, all right? You just can't go and badger people all the time and say, hey, look, I need you to do this for me. No, you have to learn it on your own, and that's what we're doing, okay, guys? And this road... It is supposed to come up, and it's supposed to go that way, which means a lot of this hillside over here needs to just go down, okay? We need to edit that and make it go down. So there's going to be a mix of creative for, like the, for stuff and things like this, because let's just put it this way, guys. The world does not generate the way we prefer it to be. Whenever the unity version comes out it will generate a lot better a lot smoother um maybe things won't pop in and out maybe i'll have a little bit more fun and freedom 
But for right now, guys, please, 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 give me some patience. Help me out with this, all right? I... I do love the support you guys have given me on the channel. Um, I guess I'm just saying that, hey, look, you know, I'm here. Really, I am. But <sighs> I just love this game. And I want to take my time with it and make the best of it that I possibly can. All right. So could you guys please just give me a little bit of patience with this I guess is what I'm asking can we sleep yet there we go it's nighttime <laughs> the pink and purple clouds there we go ah, and we're up there we go so what I want to do tomorrow for tomorrow's episode guys this is what I want to do tomorrow okay this is what I'm going to do tomorrow and I ask for you guys for your patience once again to help me out with this one all right um, for tomorrow what I want to do is I want to complete the face of this building and this building okay then we need to come up and finish the sides do the rear we need to do the sides then we'll have to do the rear of it and then we need to come up with a fire escape design for both buildings okay um which means i'm gonna have to come up with a better window design now if i come over here to this building i think i may have come up with a plan for windows over here or maybe I have it no it doesn't look like I have over here as well so we need to come up with something like that we need to do something a little bit different on this um, over here we have ourselves a little thing that we started for kind of doing something like this we're gonna complete all of this guys I want to do this with you it's gonna take ourselves maybe two I want to take maybe two weeks at, at best on this so please guys let me finish this project up and then we'll get back to the subscriber homes and until next time i'll see you guys on the flip side just please give me some patience help me out with this and i'll see you later bye